So yeah, I haven't played South Park in like a little while. I would like to continue this and see if we can make a good bit of progress tonight. Having said that, I probably won't play a, sh a ton of it tonight, maybe a little bit. At least the controller isn't um, not working like it was the last time, last time. So I was having problems the previous time I was streaming this. So what did we do last time? Last time we... can't remember all the th things I did, but I remember getting some, I think, what do you call it, marijuana? I got some prescription marijuana from medicinal fried chicken and I gave it to Class, Classy, I shall name, I think. Hey kid, you're that farting vigilante from the news, right? Yes. Not a talker, eh? Well, Sergeant wants to have a few words with you over at the station. So let me know if the audio and stuff is okay for the game. Now I've got to remember how, what the controls yeah, are because I've not played it in like a couple weeks. Drag. You need to get more of your character sheet filled out. Go over to Crunchy's Microbrews. Somebody there can help you. Crunchy's Microbrews. Oh, uh, hey, new kid. Yeah, uh, so it turns out gender is actually a little more, uh, complicated than what we talked about yesterday. Uh, okay, um, uh, could you come back to my office so we could sort this out, maybe? Uh, okay, thanks. Okay. Oh god, more talk about being cisgendered versus transgendered. Okay then. Can't remember if you can run in this. The audio is good. Right, that's fine. That's all I need to know. I guess you can't run in this. I mean, I don't know if it's been like two full weeks, but it's been close enough to it that it feels like it's been a couple weeks since I last played this game. I'll go see Mr. Mackey first about this gendered thing. That's the farting. And then I'll go see uh, Super Craig. Or go to that place they told me to go to. Uh, counselor is this way. Looks like your butt can do some crazy shit. Maybe you can use your farts to pause time. Have fun. Oh, right. So wait, I can't go over there after I've done that? I guess I need to take that cable off of the water. Nah. Did I just go in the door? So yeah, we got the pause ability, which we didn't have previously. Maybe I need to, um, not actually sure what I'm supposed to do there. So yeah, I think I talked about this, I watched the South Park episode that was on about a week ago. There's no episode this week, so I can't talk about that. I think the next episode is next Wednesday. But yeah, the the Halloween episode that they played like the week before, uh, the week before was not particularly good. It was a Halloween episode, but it was... It was, kind of, it was kind of boring, really. Like, there was nothing special about it. Oh, wait. I'm supposed to hit that then. Oh, okay. I didn't see that. 
And I can turn off the switch. No, he's not standing next to it. There we go. I think he's dead. <laughs> he's not getting up. Oh great, thanks for coming. Have a seat. Now I got some uh, some feedback from the principal that uh, our discussion about sex, I, I mean about gender, wasn't uh, precise enough. And uh, well, he, he gave me some guidelines how to do a more uh, uh, thorough pass, helping you identify your gender. Okay. Is the okay. gender that you were assigned with at birth the gender that you currently identify with? Okay. Oh, okay, great. So as you know, that means that you're cisgendered. Okay, great. Now, the next thing I want to talk to you about with your gender is your sexuality. Now, a lot of people think that gender and sexuality are the same, but no, that's bi. That's wrong, it's bi. Now, how would you describe the sex of the kinds of people you find yourself, uh, sexually attracted to? Boys, girls, neither. Oh. <laughs> Just, uh, whenever you're ready. Do you think if I pick girls, he's going to make a big deal out of it like he did with cisgendered? You know, let's do, let's do that, let's do girls. Okay, so that makes you straight or heterosexual, okay. A heterosexual cisgender boy, sure. There we go, got another um, power up sort, so we can use that. Well, I'm really glad we had this talk, okay? Just be careful, okay? Because there's, there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're going to have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime. I'm going to walk outside the school, and there's going to be a truck full of rednecks, isn't there? I'm pretty sure that's going to happen the second I step out. Oh my god, I have so much homework tonight. Hey, yep, I knew that was going to happen. We don't take kindly to your types around here. Let's welcome this thing to our town. It's kind of like fucking to catch a predator. You fucking know that as soon as the person walks out, there's going to be something out there waiting for them. So I need to reacquaint myself with the combat since it's been a little while. This is a this is one I like using. But yeah, they were here before when I did that talk about the cisgender thing. Wait, what? Well, pause, you can move freely and punch enemies by pressing A. Oh, I need to press A to actually do that. So I was trying to do the combination there, but I had to actually sort of stop it. <laughs> You're fighting out the shit out of them. I have a really good feeling about this, guys. Thanks for saving me the trouble of flipping that shit head off. I'm big again. Oh god, it's Kyle too. Oh Jesus, not again. Ha -cha -cha -cha. I might need a do over. Next time I'll show you what I really meant to do. <laughs> Fuck him up, Butho. Yeah, this game this game just gets weirder every time, I love it. Uh, let's see, I guess I'll do the fart here. Hit both of them. That's going to leave some and also knock into that foot guy. Oof. Wow, dude, you're dying out there. Here I go. Fuck 
Put this on your cougar crap. This mean I get to go back on disability? Hallelujah. I'm gonna kill out there. America, fuck yeah. That settles it. Beating you kids up with cooting friends forever. Step nice. aside, coon friends. Daddy's home. Yeah. Now go tell everyone you cut yourself manscaping. <laughs> Punch someone for the coon, fart lord. I think the coon's the next one to go down. Possibly. Yeah. Oh well. Guys, I think the coon's really dead. Good thing this game doesn't okay, have permadeath. I have had it with this shit. Yeah, another foe falls before the might of coon and friends. Let's mess with some physics. I thought I was going to finish him off, it doesn't... Way to move like you get oh well. Yeah. Wow. You gonna start taking this seriously now, Super Craig? I doubt it. Don't mess there we go. Dick bag. Easy. I wonder if we'll run into those guys again later on. I should probably equip something to that new item slot. Let's see how do we bring up the menu again. Yes, yeah, so we've got one new major slot, so let's see what we can put in there. Harvester of Fognal, the Nether Talisman, and Platinum Cool Friend Gyro. It seems generally better. After an intense session with the Elite Level World Association, Human Kite was able to convert the Harvester Juzin's binary data into kinetic energy. Whatever that means. Also 69, because 69. Right, so... I don't know how I bring up the thing that tells you, I think it's under map, like the objective. Yeah, here it is, Microaggression Academy, go to Crunchy's Microbrew, that's where we need to go next. So yeah, the current season of South Park has been a little bit lacklustre really, like it's gone back to the weekly episode format, like I've said before, but it kind of feels like that they're trying to find their footing again since they haven't done that in a few seasons. There's a microbrewery. You'll find a person inside who can assist you with race. Good luck. Super Craig, out. So hopefully, I mean the season's almost over. I think there's like two episodes left before that's it. So hopefully the next season. It will go back to what it's good at doing. Sit here and do nothing while you insult this man's ethnicity. I wasn't also, a PC principal. Excuse me. Did you or did you not say that this man seemed tired? Yes, he's my friend. I said, Paolo, you look tired. Microaggression! Ah, ah, ah. Persons of Hispanic backgrounds have been stereotyped as being sleepy and saying they look tired is a microaggression that will not stand. But I am tired. Oh, oh, uh. <laughs> you! You're the new kid, right? I'm the principal of your school, my name is PC Principal. I was told you wanted to talk to me about some race issues. Okay, come at me. Come at me, bro! Oh god, we're actually fighting him. Come on, you want to learn about race, right? Give me your best shot. It's a nice day, isn't it? What's oh wrong shit. With you? you can't just attack for no reason. Try again! It's a nice day, isn't it? What's wrong with you? You can't just attack for no reason. Try again. <laughs> I'm gonna keep doing this and see what's gonna happen. What's wrong 
with you. You can't just attack for no reason. I'm not sure if it's going to do anything if you keep doing this or if it's just going to be an endless loop. What's wrong with you? You can't just attack for no reason. Try again. <laughs> I'll do it one more time. What's wrong with you? You can't just attack for no reason. Try again. Yeah, it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Nice I'll day, just wait. Mm, yes, very good. That was indeed not a microaggression. All right, round two. I ate a hamburger last week. All right, that was also not a microaggression. This time I will use a microaggression and you will see how it gives you a free shot. All right, everybody, listen up. I'm about to use a microaggression, but it's only for the use of training this young person in the ways of the social justice warrior. Thank you, Michael Christian. About to happen. Thank you. My friend Brian looks like a chick. Microaggression. Hit him. Oh, oh. Nice. Not bad, kid. Not bad at all. Not only is the word chick derogatory to females, but also criticizing a male for looking feminine is a microaggression towards person of transgender. Now let's see if you can spot a microaggression that's more subtle. My pants are warm. My pants are warm. That coffee belongs to Tim Sherman. I heard it's going to rain. Janet likes to roller skate. What's wrong with you? You can't just attack for no reason. Nah. Try again. I'm not, sure, I'm not sure what one that is. Janet likes to roller skate. Guess it's not that one then. Mr. Yamashiro is actually a very good driver. Oh, that's a microaggression. Yeah. <laughs> Nice kid, very nice indeed. Using the term actually inferred that maybe other Asian Americans are not good drivers. And the use of Mr. is offensive to persons of third gender. Now before we talk about your race, I need you to get out there and do some PC work for me. I'll let you know when I think you're ready. <laughs> that wasn't really a fight then, that was just... I don't know, I don't even know what that was. If you don't know, PC, like, his name is PC Principal. The PC stands for Political Remember, Correct. People use microaggressions every day. I'm counting on you to make them pay for doing so. Or politically correct, rather. Let's see if I can get a selfie with people. What about you? Nope. Let's do it. Oops. Sure, Wrong button. Let's do it. I don't remember which button that is to take a picture. I think it may just be A. Oh, right, it's RB. Don't you have a side quest with Super Craig? Uh, I think I do. Hang on a second, I saw a selfie you thing there. The weirdest superhero I've seen all day. Okay, I'll follow you. <laughs> Bartender. Thanks, kid. But that was a real cool picture. So yeah, wasn't there something with like Tweak or something? Like Tweak and Craig? Uh, I can't get out of here, can I? Nah. I have to go back out the main entrance. The only reason you would have to go back there is if you want to pick up that wallet. There's nothing that valuable back there.
Is that not setting that light? I thought that would have been explode, but it doesn't. Nope. I guess I need some sort of um, firepower to actually activate that. Or like a different super friend to sort of actually activate it for me. Right, so let's have a look at the map. Yeah, there was a different Craig thing that's down there. Darn it, I don't think that vigilante is setting a good example. Not sure how long I'm going to be playing this for tonight. I might be a little bit of a shorter session. But I'll try to, I'll try to push the story forward a little bit. Let's see, I'll go this way. Next house. A minute, why is that guitar glowing? Oh, I can take that? Okay. I don't know why I thought to go down there, it's in his bedroom. He even sent me a message saying as such. There we go. Yeah, now we give this back to Tweak, isn't it? Like, it's Tweak, it's, it's Tweak that's asking for it. So we need to go back to the, the Tweak coffee shop. It's all the way over there. Is there a quick travel point we can use to get there fast? I don't remember where all the quick travel points were, like the ones that you set down. Actually, hang on a second. God, I feel like I've been waiting three years for this bus! Right, well there's a quick travel point thing over here that will take me next to the coffee shop. So that works. You make sure he knows that when you walk out on someone, you don't get to make up the rules anymore. Hello, welcome to Tweet Coffee. What can I interest you in today? Oh, he finally decided to be reasonable, huh? Fine. Here's a stupid laptop. Oh, hello, uh, new kid, right? Listen, I see you're really trying hard to get my son and his boyfriend back together, and, well, I so appreciate it. Having a gay son is really good for the coffee business. I think all they need is a little relationship counseling. Could you give this to Craig? Maybe together we can both help them out, huh? Counseling referral. Interesting. So this whole mission has just been going back and forth between those two. This Craig. whole side quest. Counseling? Tweak wants me to go to counseling with him? No way. Tell him there's no way I'll go to counseling unless you go too. I need my support team. Wait, what? Wh why, why am I getting fucking roped into your little... Hello, welcome to Tweak Coffee. Your what little tiff you with today? fucking Tweak. What's this? Relationship counseling? Craig? Are you shitting me? Well, fine, I'll do it. As long as you're there. You seem to be able to get him to think rationally. Oh boy. 
I wonder how many more times I've got to go back and forth before the side quest is over. Wait a minute, where did they go? Hello, welcome to Tweet Coffee. What can I interest you in today? It sure is super of you to help these boys out. Oh, right, I think we're done. Electropunk suit, gloves, and headwear. Cool. Sure, why not? Oh. Is that not the selfie? Sure, why not? Oh wait, did we yeah we got the selfie already for that. Can I get a selfie with Tweak now? I don't remember if I did one with him already. What did they both already go to the counselling? Okay then. Well I guess we're done with that then. You could try tossing your fight to enemies to gain an advantage in combat. Use the fart to cross them out and punch them while they're up chucking. We haven't gone into the cinema yet. Oh, wrong one. Wait, isn't that the right? I thought the 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 wheel thing was for Kate. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, I, I hit the other one. Selected. Right, here we go, time for some fart core. Let's do this. There's a Yahweh picture right there. Oh, I didn't I accidentally skip that. Hang on a second, I want to see what that was. Components? I don't remember where the collectibles go. I know it's here somewhere. Oh wait, is it under gallery? Yeah, here it is. So there's the one we just picked up. <laughs> Got these fucking yaoi pixels, by the way. I'm so glad that that's like one of the collectibles in this game. Like the first game, it was like Chim Pokemon, which is the South Park version of Pokemon, but this is much more entertaining. Not just because each drawing is different, but it's also done by a different person. It seems like, or it's done in a really different style from each other. So both of them never look the same. Smartphone. Oh, that's how you get that one. Time for diabetic rage. Diabetes. One diabetes rage coming up. See ya. Hello there. The counseling is at school. I guess that makes sense. Somewhere for 
Somebody call for a fast pass? That was kind of funny how he was still stirring now while he was like dashing away. You know, we need to go see the the police as well. We'll do that after this. Better run fast. Better run fast. Better run fast. Better run faster, 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 faster. There you go. Okay. I think I did this already. Yeah. What can I do Whoa, for what you, the fuck? Did, what did, can you, I do for you, new kid? did you see that? Like, the second I left the selfie screen, he was standing on top of the chair for a fraction of a second and then immediately sat back down. Okay. Like, watch, watch again. Like, watch really closely. Oh no, he didn't do it that time. He did it the first oh, time there, I noticed okay. that. That was weird. Nah, he doesn't seem to be doing it anymore. If you missed that, then I don't think there's a way for me to show it on the stream, but I could probably show it in post-edit. Like when it's on YouTube. Maybe I did this and then I cancelled. Yeah, <laughs> there it is. So I took a picture and then he was standing and then he fucking went back sitting down. Right, so watch again, he does it for like half a second. <laughs> it's not as really easy to do that, you just take a picture then cancel. That's all you have to do. They're in the gym. Yeah, we're not getting um we're not getting relationship counselling, I thought they were gonna be with the counsellor. AKA Mackie. Nope, they're not here. I'll check the other, the other rooms. Also, there's an audio glitch here. It's playing that electric sound effect, like there's water and electric here, but there's not. Like, I already got rid of that, so I don't know why it's playing it. That's locked. Maybe I need to sit on the chair. No. Oh, somebody must know where they are. Oh my god, I have so much homework tonight. I don't remember how you bring up the the quest lines. In this. Wait a minute. Show mission list. Oh, there it is. Uh, there doesn't seem to be a, a continuing mission for them going to. I, th I think the quest was complete when I talked to the dad in the coffee shop because he gave me a bunch of stuff. So I don't think there actually is counselling. At least not right now. Maybe it's a side quest that opens up after I've done some things. So I'm just going to head to the police station now because I think that's all I can do there. Oh, hi, TD Raichu. Kid in town. Or Raichu. I don't know if you want me to say the full name, but how are you doing tonight? Doing good? So yeah, let's go here. Oh, awesome. Catch you later. So yeah, I think if there is like a follow-up, it's probably after I've done some things. So we'll just continue with the main quest. No, titties for you! Oh wait, PlayStation is there. So yeah, we need to talk to the chief of police right now. Be? A yoga instructor? Go on through. 
Sorry, I don't selfie with just anyone. Whoa, what the fuck? Did his voice just change there? Who are you supposed to be? A drum major? What are you supposed to be? A rodeo clown? Wait, listen to his voice. Who are you supposed to be? Dork man? Who are you supposed to be? A gay ninja? And then when I do the selfie, I listen to his voice. Sorry, I don't selfie with just anyone. So that's weird. So then the WAP says to the Polak, if I wanted tits, I'd have beat up the nip in the black guy's hat. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. oh, what do we have here? You're the one who made the news last night, huh? Well, the police can always use the help of concerned citizens. I guess we can give our little junior detective a special kitty case to work on. All right, listen up. There's somebody new to town shaking up the crime families. This is a real bad dude. A kingpin of crime who wants to control all the drugs in the city. We've tracked him to this location here. I need you to go in and neutralize him. You lead point, and my boys will be there after. If you take out the drug kingpin, we'll give you this junior detective badge. Pretty neat, huh? Now get out there! <laughs> That's also a joke from a South Park episode. There's an episode around the four main kids playing detective and then they end up getting roped into like a big serious police detective case. And then they do a joke like that where it's like, oh, we'll, we'll talk down to you, we'll be like, oh, do you want a little kiddie case? Like, we'll, we'll, we'll give you something easy so that you can get this junior detective badge. And then it's like, okay, there's this, there's this drug lord in this house with several other people. They've, they're armed and dangerous. You must go in there and take them out. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna fast travel. It's like on the other side of the map. Need to get somewhere fast, you kid. Better run fast. We haven't been to Kenny's house yet, I don't think. Like Kenny's house, I think, is on the very far end of the map. There you go. Because like, his house is in the slums area. Also, we can't go into you store it yet. I think we need to go in there to advance the plot, but it's locked right now because of the lava. But yeah, I do recall them talking about finding out that the person that stole the cat was hiding out at you store it. So we'll need to come back here once that Where becomes. Cats? Fucking scaredy cats. Once that becomes unlockable, we can go there. No! You want some of this, poor thing? Okay, you're approaching the hideout. Find a way in, but be careful. He's probably armed to the teeth. Thermal imaging is showing the suspect is in the rear of the house. You're making a big mistake messing with Kunin, friends. It's go time. I like who was telling me that just to stop the a normal battle. That's a new mechanic now. Awesome. Ow. Have your boyfriend massage that for you. It's my turn now. Ha, ha, ha. -uh. Took that like a champ, Forthy. You need help, but no one wants to hear a spoiler. Yeah, I don't want to hear spoilers either, to be honest. I'm still quite early into the game. Bleah. 
Sorry, I, I don't know if I want to hear spoilers right now. What the hell did they just do there? Who needs to get punched the most? Did he just show him porn on the phone and he recovered health? I, I suppose that's a way to recover health, sure. Which one was... oh wait, it's him up there. Fuck. I was wondering which one was doing the bowling thing, it's him over there. I'm not going to be able to reach him now, so... Yeah, sorry, I, I won't be able to help you on that, I'm afraid. Maybe, maybe go on Twitch and see if you can find people playing it there and ask them. Yeah, I kind of let that happen by accident. Just these two guys left? Yeah. I haven't played this in like a week and a half, so if I suck right now, that's just because I haven't played for a little bit. I've been playing Mario Odyssey recently. That's probably one of my favourite ultimate animations, just because of the stock pictures in the background. It makes it all the more funny just to watch that. There we go. Oh, there's one left, fuck. There we go. Get up, new kid. We beat them without you. Nice. You dropped this up in the lake. Cool. Thank you. I'm having problems with uh uh what what's it called? Streamlabs? Like Streamlabs that pops up notifications. I'm having problems with that, like because it might not show you that says that you subbed in late. I'm actually gonna look that up. Let's see. This will take a second. Let's try logging in with YouTube right now. So yeah, Streamlabs is a thing that I use that pops up the notifications of people that sub and like the channel and stuff. But lately I've noticed it's not been popping up anything, so I'm thinking there's something wrong with Streamlabs' side of things. Let's see, alert box. I'm just checking it right now. I mean, it should it should be working. The dashboards. Recent events. Last sub was eleven days ago. That's weird. 
I don't know if he subbed this second, maybe it takes like a little while for it to apply. Anyways, let's continue. But yeah, Streamlabs has been a bit weird lately with the with the notifications. I'm not sure if it's just me or if this is like a service-wide thing where other people are having problems also. I didn't quite catch what PC Principles said there. Nice one. The sixth grader knew that sissy was a project progerative term for any male who doesn't conform to standard male gender roles. Oh yeah, that was the last thing we did before we ended the last stream. Like we took a picture with Classy, I think her name is. Right, so here we go. Time to time to go to this dangerous house. Is this the house? Oh no. Right, okay. I was thinking to myself, what's so dangerous about Big Gal? It's actually this house. Can't seem to hit that. Did you read the crew post I see Instagram? Uh, what post? Alright, good luck with that. Time to kill. Hope that goes well for you. You'll probably find someone who's fairly late game. I'm still f quite early into it. I think I'm like about six to eight hours in. So not that far at all. You mean Craig? Stripes in my bedroom. Oh, right, that's because I was in the basement looking for his guinea pig. That's nothing. Sight. Hey, who are you? What are you doing in my house? Engage! Engage! Uh. Defeat the drug dealer, apparently. I don't know what you're doing in my house. Stand your ground. Yeah, so one of the running themes of South Park, like running gags, is that the police are very racist What's and they'll just you? arrest black people. So <laughs> that I think that's what's going on here. House, I don't think this guy's a drug dealer at all. Nonetheless, we must follow orders, I guess. If we want that junior detective badge, we have to. Degenerate this town has to deal with. Please come by and help us again. Operation Just Cause. Well, I suppose while I'm here, I can ransack the house. Because why not? Okay, kid, I'll give you a pity follow. What the heck? That girl was called Red. Thanks. Red health girl called Red. Hashtag it pleases and sparkles. Nice. Holy shit, 436 likes already in like two seconds. That's a record. Have you seen my dad? I'm not sure where he went. It's not like him to just disappear. Well, okay, sure. Guess we're just gonna keep hush hush on what just happened downstairs. Sure. Thanks, new kid. See you online. 
you kid pity selfie. Nice. Not that the new kid can talk anyway, yeah. Guess we can use the bathroom? Yep. The Daniels' toilet. So we haven't done this in a while. Yeah, they've definitely made the toilet things more involving than previously. And then shake it off. There we go. That wasn't so bad. I've seen some pretty difficult ones, like a five star toilet, but that was a three star, that was alright. So I don't know what happens when you do that to all of the toilets in the town, I guess. You get something good. Wait a minute, I'm seeing an interact thing. Oh, wait, it's that. I think, yeah. Never mind. I thought I was getting like a, a prompt on the carpet there, like when I was walking by it, but I was just walking by the toilet. Right, so we will now do something else, I guess. I think I'll get another. Hey, Forthy, want to see a naked picture of your mom? Who wants the first cut? Punch someone for the coon, fart lord. Fast pass brings into action. Yeah. Uh, that a sonic boom is just their jaw cracking. Have a really good feeling about this, guys. You pussy microaggression. Hit him. Nice. Yeah, the sixth grade does seem to go and do microaggressions a lot. That sucks for you. Uh, ah, you fuck with the coon, you answer to his friends, right, guys? Avenging you is on my to do list. Yeah, I'm undoing that one. Oh my god, the butt lord fucked you. For fourthy scum, you guys are kind of scrappy. If you'll excuse me, I have a balloon to piss in. Get excited. Don't mess this up, dickbag. Going to leave some scars. I'm big. Oh god, it's him again. Oh Jesus, not again! Hacha! <laughs> oh no, my glazies! You're all welcome. Oh, that's right. They did promise that he would come and play. That's why he's popping up randomly now. I completely forgot about that conversation. Yeah, because the last time we fought the Brovlaskis, like the entire family except for the dad. And at the end, we had to make an agreement that uh, Kyle's brother, Kyle, uh, his, his name is also Kyle. So we basically made a promise for him to take part in the fights as well, and that's what's basically co coming down to, like just him doing nothing. Not 
Somebody wake me when it's my turn. Coonin friends nice. forever. Nice. Okay, who's the next target of my unbridled rage? God, that was really satisfying. Rip. I can't say no to kicking some forthy ass. He was gonna die anyway from that attack. I'm not sorry for what I'm about to do. I have had it with this shit. Impressive who's someone who can't break the laws of physics. Fuck him up, I hope. Keep it up, kid. We might be friends someday. This is for scrambles, you bastards! <laughs> I died before he could even do that. Privilege checker. Master privilege checker, rather. New message from PC Principal. Thanks for dressing down the 6th grader. I'd rather not go into why, but the words crush and pussy trigger a particularly negative re reaction from me. You've been fairly clear in the past that you are tolerant. Your tolerant views and fight for social justice are to help you. And I quote, crush puss. <laughs> God damn it, Jim, Jim quit victimising me. Again, if you haven't seen a certain episode, you wouldn't get that. You would have to, like, if you watch the entire series, you'll probably get all the jokes. My brain is killing me, his microphone was up his ass, and he had a speech impediment and his mic was shitty. And my brain is aching. Uh, who are you talking about? Little superhero, I know you're out there saving kitties. If you come across any of my kitties and their pink scarves, can you bring them back to me? I can't find them anywhere. My kitties are being hunted by those mean sixth graders. If you see any of my furry babies, come talk to me, okay, honey buns? Big gay owls, big gay cats. Find them, return them. Oh, Jesus, where, oh, where could those pussies have gone? <laughs> hey, cutie patootie, how about a selfie? Yeah, I don't know if anyone remembers him from the first game in Stick of Truth. <laughs> Ooh, Jesus, Jesus Christ, thank you. My only G-rated picture, oh, oh God. Without giving any anything away, uh, Mr. Slave played a big role in the f near finale of the last game. It was quite it was quite an experience. I'll just leave it at that. Also, Yowie picture, extracurricular, nice. I'm guessing this is Big Gal's room. Actually, I'm guessing it's both the rooms because of the two the two pillows. I don't I don't know why I thought for a second that they would sleep in separate beds. Like, of course they would sleep together. Biggie Owls, Biggie Bidet, Bidet, I have no idea if that's how you pronounce that. But uh, and here we go, another toilet challenge. So apparently the new Call of Duty comes out tomorrow, and I'm not interested. 
I mean, some people will probably like it because it's going back to World War II, but I wasn't really into the World War II shooters to begin with. That and I've sort of fallen out with Call of Duty in general just because it kind of feels like they don't really listen to people and they've been doing it like an annual game for so long now that I've just kind of lost interest in general. Like, I drew the line at Advanced Warfare, I think that was the game... <laughs> okay, I, th I think Advanced Warfare was the game where I sort of drew the line and was like, okay, I'm done with this series for at least a while. I haven't really gotten back to that series since, like... I think the last really good game for me was Black Ops 2, and then after that it was just kind of like, eh. Black Ops and Black Ops 2, especially the first Black Ops, were fantastic games. And Modern Warfare 1 was also amazing. So I haven't played the remastered of Modern Warfare 1, but I know that they've, like, put, like, loot boxes and bullshit like that in it, because of course they would, because AAA industry video game developers would do that. There's another Yaoi picture. Who's your semi? Girls rule, boys rule. Do you, do you think that's a microaggression right there? Do you think I should just punch that picture? That Just punch that whole thing? Microaggression! Where am I going right now? I don't know, I'm just kind of exploring a bit. And then I'll check... I'll check the, the quest line. I mean, I haven't been in this part of South Park just yet. On the subject of Call of Duty though, there's this... Oh, there's another Yaoi picture. Starlight Whispers. Nice. Another 10 more and I'll get another upgrade thingy. So, on the subject of Call of Duty, with that new game coming out, some people have got the game early and they've discovered that the new game has a very... a very scummy way of dealing with loot boxes. Use some more female heroes. So, if you haven't heard about this, basically what they're now doing... You want a selfie? With me? Okay. What they're doing now with Call of Duty is you can buy loot boxes to get, like, guns and shit. Like, that's like something you could do already in like previous games or previous it's, it's game. Amazing. I'm not sure how many games they've done that with, like maybe two at most. But in this game, you buy loot boxes, they drop into the map in the middle of a match. This oh, is amazing. I'm going to take a picture so he doesn't interrupt me. So you buy it in the middle of a match, then the box Ooh, drops really onto the like? map. In Nobody else can open it, it's just you because you're the one who paid for it. But you can open it and it will show everyone else around you what you've got in that box. So basically it's meant to tempt other people into buying loot boxes because they'll see the cool shit that you get in your box and they'll be like, oh cool, maybe I can buy a loot box and I'll get stuff like that. I just think that's like really scummy that they would even think of doing that, but it's there. It's in the new game. Coon cakes. YouTube is selfie with Ike. Let's do a better one. Fillmore. Yay, now we're real friends. I like how they get actual kids to do the voices for like the kindergartners. Let's do that for Ike as well. It's funnier with Ike though because they get the kid to actually swear, like he's sweared a number of times 
in, in South Park. That vigilante should leave farting on criminals to the police. Yuck. Alright, let's check the quest lines. Talk to the detective, that's the main quest, I think. Below recommended night. Raisins on the rampage. Master all the Raisins Ripper character sheet titles. Maybe I've got a new artifact that can boost my attack power. Let's see, artifacts. Apparently we need to be at least 200 to do the next one. Oh, this will push up nicely. Let me just check the stats of those. Six four six. Six five six. Yeah, this one's better. Oh wait a minute. That's already there. We could use that one though. Sweet. Right, we're ready to take on the next mission then. That'll be we're talking to the detective again. Oh hang on a second. Let me Fuck. Maybe if I go back up here and down again, it'll come back out of the bush. I think I need to freeze time and grab that cat. I think that's one of Big Gay Owl's cats. Yep. Big Gay Shadow. <laughs> yeah, I've seen a few cats that run into bushes, so I think I just need to grab those. Right, I'm going to save here real quick because there is one thing that I found out about Welcome that you can do here tacos. that I didn't do before. But I only found out about this through someone else. So let me go back here and I wouldn't do that if I were you. You're digging your own grave, kid. Now you can fight Morgan Freeman. Let's see if we're you powerful enough to take him on. Bad, huh, kid? Well, I'll be the judge of that. You wouldn't like Morgan Freeman when he's... Undo. Your turn is now property of Spoon and Friend. Let's mess with some physics. I guess he's way too strong. I mean, what's his strength at? Oh shit, 9999. Uh, can we run away? Yeah, I think we're dead. You do something? I was too busy not giving a fuck. God damn it, Super Craig! Show some respect to your colleagues. Why start now? See, so yeah, we may need to come back to this one. Put this on your boots, Craig. Morgan Freeman is about to go Mel Gibson on your ass. Listen to my heavenly voice and gaze upon my freckles. Congratulations, you've just been Freeman. <laughs> Let's make this quick. Ow. Oh, nice try. It's over 9,000. Yeah, we're not even close to getting rid of his health. I could stack bleeding and gross out though, but I don't think that's going to help too much. I'm trying to run a respectable restaurant here, kid. Super Craig, reporting for duty. I usually move a whole lot faster than me. I don't remember how you. You're ready. Okay. Yeah, I don't remember how you undo the charmed effect. I'm gonna kill out there. Good. Got the 
solid wallop. Step aside, coon friends. Daddy's home. Ugh. Get your mom to kiss that boo boo. Is this the end of Morgan Freeman? No, this is not. I don't think I can attack him from here. Nope. Yeah, all of his attacks. Can only aim left or right, don't aim up or down. Gonna have to pass my pump ton on that. Next, listen to my heavenly voice and gaze upon my freckles. Congratulations. No. I can't afford to. You've just been Freeman. Can't afford to have him charmed my main character. Can't afford to make him charmed new kids. I'm all revved up and ready. Ready for their spin up in Turkish markets at least. Oh, am I up? Ah, oh, shit. Yep, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Red Fuck. Repeat, I shouldn't have done that reverse thing. I had a feeling he was going to do that next, but I had no way of telling. I had a feeling I was going to die anyway because I had the feeling he was going to be way too powerful. I just wanted to see what would happen if I tried fighting him. My blood pumping. Come back when you're stronger and we can do this again. You're dead. Well, that was fun. We're not going to come back to that for a long time. Like, maybe near the end of the game, we'll check that out. To get somewhere for fair, 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 fair quickly. R r righteous. Catch you later. Whoa. Supposed to be a yoga instructor. Go on through. Hey, little crime stopper, back for more? I got something you might be interested in. Turns out that scum you fucked up is just the low guy on the totem pole. We now believe the real kingpin is over here, on your phone, that I'm holding right now. Thanks for letting me hold your phone to show you this. <laughs> He's hiding out in some big luxury mansion bought with blood money, scumbag. This is a whole nother level, little crime fighter. His house is like a fortress. Every window and door is wired to a state-of-the-art, high-tech security system. You'll need this. This mobile hacking device will help you bypass the security system. This gonna be fun. 
police hacking device mission item take all. Here we go then. Apparently our strength is enough to take on this mission, like we needed 200, I think we've got about 210. Oh, there's a... I didn't even know there was a Yowie picture there. I was looking at the the profile faces on the billboard, the, the whiteboard. Uh, what's this? Organic jelly donut. Jelly donuts! Oh yeah, isn't there meant to be like a Pokemon movie coming out this month? It's meant to be like a retelling of the pilot or something, like the first the first season of the show, something like that. I think that's this month. Like, I'm not going to get Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon anytime soon, but I would, wouldn't mind checking that out, because that looks pretty good. As far as Pokemon movies go, that might actually be something... It might actually be half decent. Because most Pokemon movies after like the second one are kind of lackluster. Because the first one is pretty good, second one is also really good, and then the third one was kind of eh, and then after that it was just like, I, could, I couldn't really get invested in the later stuff. The Yolanda wig costume. So I could try that. Doesn't that come under wigs? I mean, doesn't wigs come under hair? Or is it under head? Oh, it's under head. <laughs> Alright, let's do that one for a while. Police women's toilet, four star rating. Oh, so while I'm doing this, I'm not realising there's like titles for each challenge. Like Moist Blanket is one of them there. That was kind of tricky, that one. But we still finished it. Oh. Your land address. Oh, I know what this is referencing. Right. I just realised. I mean, I guess I might as well try this one. Close. Nope, that's not it. There is. Your land address. Kind of change the colour of that one. Can change the colour of this one, actually. Don't know what colour I should use for the gloves, like red as well or a different colour. Well, let's try purple. Nah. How about hot pink? Yeah, it kinda works. Do 
do you think a cisgendered heterosexual boy dressing up as a woman is a microaggression? Do you think I should punch myself in the face? Hey, guy. Let's see, Tatico Grande. I'm starting to fucking sound like Jimmy. Restores a large amount of health. Okay then. And there's a revival thingy. Hey, nah, I don't really need to buy anything. Right, let's go to this mission. Need to get somewhere fast, you kid. Better run fast. Yeah, better run fast, better run faster. Faster, faster, faster. See you, new kid. I wonder if I'll run into the Raisins girls again, like the Raisins girls that caught me in the back alley there. I need to get back there to catch the, catch the cat. K -k 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 -k. I didn't get the name of that there. Big Gay Loki and then Big Gay Shadow Right, we're almost at the mission area Just a little bit further to go Let's see how we're doing for time because I might end up ending the stream very soon Just a second please uh, yeah, I think I'm going to end in like maybe 10-15 minutes. A little bit of a shorter session tonight, just because I did Odyssey for a while. Lucky day, superhero. Looks like the guard is on a piss break or something. Proceed past the gate and around the back to find an entry point. And also because I started late tonight. Well, apparently I need to find a way behind that. Yeah, a way around it. iPad for kids for internet, safe space. Something. I didn't read all of that. Oh, you think going around... You think going up there would make you go behind that gate, but apparently not. Local police definitely not racist, is what I just picked up there. Oh, right, okay. Not this time, sir. Not this time. Please move the fuck along, or I will fuck you up non lethally. I will beat you until my shift is over, sir. I will not be humiliated again. This time I got backup. Should I tell you what to do? Would that help? That dog just pissed there. How much health does he have? 520. Yeah. Now 
go tell everyone you cut yourself manscaping. I figure I get rid of the dogs first, and that will help me. Can't really attack them from there, so I'll just shield myself. I wish I was a real cop, sir. Suck spray. Huh? Justice is sprayed. Suck spray. My turn. Damn it! Can't fucking attack him. I guess I'll attack him instead. Got something for ya. Uh, this calls for excessive force. Blah, blah, blah. Fast pass springs into action. Now you see me? Dude, pace yourself. I don't think the dog can attack you while you're invisible. So to rescue a cat, we've got to kill a bunch of dogs. And the cat was called Scrambles. I was trying to remember what its name was, but that's what it's called. I'm gonna attack him actually because other one will die from bleeding. Also, the ultimate is really nice. Get that kid. Oh shit! More reinforcements. This might be the perfect character to use to do this ultimate one. On account that everybody gets bullied. Oh, you just assaulted an officer of the lawn. <laughs> officer of the lawn. Fantastic. Rip. Oh, I forgot my antiseptic nasal cream. <laughs> it still is bleeding. Really badly. Oh boy, superheroes are so fun. <laughs> Go down, new kid. So that's going to be the new car thing now, every time we'll just fucking come by once in a while just to pester us. Waste our time. Uh, let's see, what do I want to do? Can't attack the two back there, so we'll just attack wow, him. Stack Gross out on top of the bleeding. Here 
I go. Come and get me, Dick. Uh. Tell them how you really feel, Super Craig. Let's mess with some physics. of Coon and Friends. I graduated seventh in my online class. That so one's not swirl. as bad. Dude, that was bad ass. Confused though. I'm still bleeding out of all orifices. Ah, that was epic. Nice. So when confused happens, they do a, an attack randomly. Like I'd have no control over that, but they can they attack the enemy, so no worries. Right, he's almost dead. Just a little bit further. Let's make this quick. Uh, stop, bro! I'll call someone with the authority to shoot. Uh, I practiced that in front of a mirror. Yeah, I saw that coming. Sixty nine per cent. I can see down now. Don't mess this up, dick bag. I was trying to get rid of that fish. I feel like I'm carrying this whole organization. Uh, you gonna start taking this seriously now, Super Craig? I doubt it. Uh. I'm not sorry for what I'm about to do. I've had it with this dick. Way to use your head. Next time, try putting a little heart into it. Let's take things fast. You want to heal? I got to heal. Yeah. Sweet, thanks. Oh, this is my favorite part. There we go. He's dead. Yeah, that one wasn't too bad. Also, oh, while I was fighting there, I noticed that backpack in the corner. Let me see if I can grab that. I like that, that when you're fighting you can see all the items and stuff in the background, so it shows you that, yeah, there is stuff you can grab. And there you go, easel axe meds. What's over here? Nothing? Yeah, there's nothing back here. Yeah. I thought there'd been something else over there, but there's actually hang on. 
Oh, never mind. I thought I saw something there. There's a duffel bag. Full of stuff. Sweat soaked at sock. It's a biohazard weapon. Hacking minions. Is everything all right? Oh shit. Get out of here. Stay away from those drugs. We fucked up. I thought I was supposed to hover over that triangle, but it didn't work. So hang on a second. Alright, we can go back. Well, that sucks. Let's try that again. I hope I don't have to do that whole fight again. I should have saved it before I'd have tried that. Wait! Wait! Yeah, I'm getting tired now, so I think after I'm done with this, I'm just going to save and quit. We didn't really push the story that much tonight, but we'll do probably a big chunk of it next time to make up for that. Need to get somewhere fast, you kid. Are we doing this or what? Yeah, it's a little bit. It's a little bit annoying trying to get there due to the lack of quick travel points that are close enough to it. Like there's one that's a little bit closer, but then there's the lava that sort of blocks your way, so you have to go this way instead. When am I going to do the summon? I don't know. I'll do it at some point, just uh, whenever the fight gets really hard, I guess. I don't think you can use summons on boss fights, but you can you can use them on regular fights. So if a fight gets really difficult or if I'm about to lose, I guess I could use a summon. Hello, now let's try this again. Wolf Home Security. Is everything all right? Hello, yes, sorry, I live here and I can't remember my code. Oh, that's okay, sir. Do you have your security password you can tell me? Can you hold on just a minute? Okay, so the last minute of that didn't Is work. All right? There we go. Is everything all right? Uh, yes, no problem. I've got it right here. Hang on a second. Dang it, let me look in. Oh, wrong drawer. Can you hold on just a minute? I'm sorry. No problem, sir. Continue hacking. Can you hold on just a minute? Stalling for time. Can you hear me? Did you maybe write the password down anywhere, sir? Like a notepad or something? Yes, yes, must be something. Let's see. Let me check in this drawer. Ah, looks like they need to find my glasses here. Hold on. <laughs> one more hack. Yep, let's do one more hack then. Is everything all right?
we become an elite hacker. It was that easy. Maybe it's my middle name? Could you, could you try my middle name? Okay, sir, I tell you what, let's just look up your account profile and get a new password for you. If we can just hang on a line here. <laughs> be fooled by his attempts at upper middle class sensibility. Oldest trick in the book. Wait a minute, I know whose house this is. I think this is Tolkien's house. Or Tupperware. Once again, the police ten tend to go for black people in South Park. Remember trapper keepers? Sure, I remember those. Oh, yeah, love those. I remember. Remember assaulting the school in the last game? Oh, I remember then everything. Remember? Casadilla. Especial recipe. There's a lot of things I can do as well, just um... Don't feel you have to remind me to do these things, like I've got the quest list right there on the map. I'm just doing this one because this is like the the topmost one on the list, which is usually the one that pushes the story forward. Careful with this one, hero. He's got a temper on him. Choose your moment now. Hey, who the hell are you? You can't just break in here. Engage! Go, go, go! Defeat the kingpin. I have a security system, you know. Salt and battery. The cops will be here. Any wow. Choke hold. Invasion! Please just leave. Well, that was easy. Make sure he doesn't stand his ground. Netwit fitness tracker. Brilliant work, hero. You're really getting into the program. You understand exactly what we're doing, and you're doing it right along with us. Meet me back at the station. I've got something for you. I'm going to go back in there real quick, see if I can find Tolkien, get a selfie with him. Assuming he's in the house right now, he should be. I just don't know which one is his bedroom. I guess here are Freedom Pals. Fuck, it's locked. Nope. Oh, there's that dramatic music again. Right, as soon as we go in here. So it won't be happening tomorrow. Hang on, what day is it today? Right, it won't be happening in the next couple of days. But if I'm to stream on the 5th, which is... A Sunday. If I'm to stream on the Sunday, you might hear fireworks outside because it is Guy Fox night on the 5th in the UK. Like, sometimes people will let off fireworks early, like in the days leading up to it, but that's the night where there's going to be a lot of fireworks even into the late hours. So if I do stream on the Sunday night, I don't know if the microphone's going to pick it up, it might not, unless it's like really loud ones. So that's just a heads up. If I do stream on Sunday night, expect a little bit of background noise. 
and the British references to Tolkien. So this is his room, but I don't see Tolkien. Oh shit, we've got a game update. Guess we're not going to be playing Super Mario Odyssey on the Kama Games Fair tonight. Yeah, I have no idea where he went. Nah, I don't see him. I'm guessing I'm guessing he's hiding in the the basement there. But we need to get a code or something, or hack that panel to get in there. There's a lot of good loot in here though, like in this house, just because it's a much bigger house than all the other ones. Right, I'm going to go back to the Chief of Police and I think he's going to give me something and then we'll just wrap up after that. Where is the quick travel point? It's this way. I guess you can only hit those things once before they become unhittable. It's not like if you go away for a while and come back you can hit them again to get more shit. Also it's been almost a year since I moved out, if you can believe that. I was going to talk about that actually, about like the moving out and what I might do for the anniversary of that, but that's not like for another couple weeks, so I might talk about it next time I stream. I didn't really think about it till just now. Hey, Mist. I'm the f f fastest kid in town. I'm going to be ending the stream very shortly, but you can watch me play for the next five minutes. It might not even be that, I'm just going to go to... I'm just going to talk to this one guy and I think that ends the quest. Catch you, later. you can probably tell that I'm sounding a bit tired tonight, so that might also be why I want to end the stream soonish. But my commentary has been... I would say my commentary has been bad, but it's always been bad, it's just been worse than, than usual. And yeah, I think that Streamlabs notification thing is broken. I'm going to have to look into that. Who are you supposed to be? A New York fashion editor? In fact, I'm going to check Go right now. Through. Hang on a sec. Because somebody said that they subscribed. I don't know if it went through. Just a second. Uh, no, it's not like they said they subscribed. Um, hang on a minute. Oh, I can't, I can't. I was going to check my phone there, but my phone's in the other room charging. Right, so never disregard. Yeah, I'm having issues with the notifications that tell you, like, who's, who subscribed and who likes the channel and stuff. Follows the channel, sorry. But it's, lately it's just been having issues where it's not displaying anything. So I wonder if it's if it's my account that's having problems or if it's actually an issue with the thing itself. Good work on clearing that kingpin, little crime stopper. I wish I had a hundred more like you on the force. The shield of shining eagle. That's an artifact. Fifty-four. Got gumption, Crime Stopper. Huddle up, it's selfie time. Sergeant Yates. Aha, now I can monitor you on the internet. Rookie mistake, superhero. <laughs> Hashtag serve and protect. Hashtag law and order. Hashtag nice. Hashtag Coons to pick. Follow me, Coons to pick. Wait. It says hashtag Coons to pick twice. Not sure if 
glitch or intentional, but hero, photo, kunstaku, follow back. Life amazing, photo me, kunstapik, follow me, but lord, like winning, follow back. Yeah, there's quite a few things here. Let's see, ang angry. Angry life, hot, photo, butt loaf, follow back. I like butt loaf, like that just sounds funny to me. Yeah, I guess I do need to talk to him next. But like, I'll tell you what, we'll do that next time. Where is he located? He's over there. Right, we'll walk over there and we'll save it and we'll do that first thing next time. Hey, you're getting a lot of buzz around the old precinct, new kid. Swing by my office in the police station. I want to talk about an amazing grassroots marketing opportunity. But Lord, I have to say I'm mildly impressed with the progress you're making. Come to the coon lair. I've got a little surprise for you. Coon has Right, we'll have to do that next time as well. I'm pretty much ready to stop the stream now. I like, would do that now, but I'm ready to end it. So yeah, not a whole lot of progress tonight, but we did a little bit of it at least. Next time I'll do a bigger chunk of the game. Hopefully the next major story component. Kitty, kitty, kitty. Come on, kitty. Ew. You want some of this, Forthy? Oh. Nice. Right, let's get these guys. Let's get this over with really quickly then. You're making a big mistake messing with Coon and friends. Punch someone for the Coon, Fart Lord. Not bad, new kid. Oh, is a little forthy about to cry? Microaggression. Hit him. <laughs> Microaggression. No. It's not like you even need to press a button to trigger the microaggression thing to begin with. It just tells you when to press the button. This is coming together exactly how I planned. Coon on the prowl. Make way for Coon. A bow has volume. Yeah, these guys are piss easy. I choose you. It's my turn now. Speak your piss. Did someone call for a fist in the face? Omega Crash Extra. You deserve what you've got. It's go time, butt lord. I don't care if I miss all of those. He's still dead. Turbo main suit, wristband, and electrodes costume. Good to sixth grade. I'll try to equate crying with the weakness when it's just really just a way of expressing empathy for marginalized groups. What? I have no idea what you're talking about. 
Right, so I believe this is the place. Yeah, it's here. Right, so I'll save that and we'll talk to Mosquito next time and then we'll go to see Kun and do a bunch of other stuff. So yeah, again, not a whole lot of story being pushed forward this time, but I think next time there's going to be a more significant bit of story to be done. Like the last major part of the story we did was the whole... What was it? It was the whole thing with going to the strip club and fighting mafia people or something like that. That was kind of fun. So hopefully we can get another session where it's just basically that for a good couple hours and then we'll take it from there.